July 31st. Birthday. 66 years old today, folks. Reminds me of a song. <laughs> I don't carry a tune, but today is your birthday. It's my birthday too, yeah. Today's your birthday. It's my birthday too, yeah. We're gonna have a party party. We're gonna have a party party. I'm gonna do some partying. You only get to be 66 once. So let's enjoy it. I knew the guards at funeral homes needed to carry them kind of weapons. Yeah, so I had to get myself a, a birthday present. I won't let you know what it is until it actually comes, in case something happens. But uh, when I do get it, I'll, uh, I'll show it to you. I bought a couple of things, so. Yay, happy birthday! <laughs> okay, I've got to go in for a shower. It's about that time. Once a month. <laughs> Not quite, but man, when you're living in a van, uh, my van does have a shower in it, but um, I haven't even been able to get in the room. I got taken too much stuff with me, so once I get that cleaned up, then I'll be able to shower in there. But for now, we're just going to go to the indoor swimming pool here. They have showers. Cost you two bucks. Cheap. Have a good, nice, long, hot shower. Oh, much better. feel much better now after shower. Hi guys, I need a favor. I got something to ask you guys. All you uh, electricians or somebody that knows something about um, electricity. So, this is my dilemma. Help me out here in figuring this out. I have two 6 volt batteries connected to give you 12 volts. Off the battery, I have two cables and they're number two wires which are pretty thick and they run to a 1500 watt 1500 watt inverter uh, the positive has a well right now it has a hundred amp fuse in it I know it's not enough for the 1500 watt uh, inverter but I had a thousand watt inverter in there and I have the same problem so I don't think it's the fuse itself but let me give you the rest of it out of the inverter I have th I have three outlets one outlet goes uh, directly to a microwave and it's supposed to be like a 700 watt microwave but I have this uh, little unit I can plug into the wall and then I can plug the uh, microwave into it and it gives you how many watts it's drawing and how many amps and what have you so on so on and so forth I have a microwave that's rated at 700 watts and yet when I plug it in it draws a thousand watts no, no big deal so the thousand watt inverter that I had the, fir the first one okay that wouldn't probably hold it but I have a 1500 watt inverter on there now should be plenty but when I turn it on, 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 even on low, but if I turn it on, I can run it for about a minute and a, a little over a minute, and then the breaker pops. It's a 100 amp breaker. So, like with a 1,000 watt inverter, you need an 85 amp fuse, a, a breaker. It pops. I can p push the button and connected it again it's not just a, a burn up burn out fuse uh, now I have a 1500 watt uh, inverter and yeah you should have like a 150 amp breaker but that's no big deal because I had the 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 thousand watt inverter on there and it still blew the, the breaker a hundred amp breaker and I have nothing else hooked up so it goes directly from the batteries number two wiring through a breaker and then um, through the inverter 
and then nothing else plugged into the inverter just one cable one plug in to the uh, a small uh, microwave and I can't run it even for well just over a minute so I've had a lot of suggestions already and I know if you guys are going to give me some suggestions I probably already tried that and what have you um, it draws 9 amps um, the, the, the uh, microwave draws 9 amps, 1,000 watts on high. Even if I put it down to like half, 50%, I might be able to run it for 2 minutes and then it, turn it on again. I can keep doing that. I can barely heat up a bowl of soup, let's say, and if I run it 2 or 3 times in a row, then it'll pop the breaker. The wires get a little warm and they shouldn't get warm at all because it's number two wire otherwise I got to go to like a, a one or a zero or, you know and and that's that's too big I mean number two wire they say should should handle that so if you guys got any ideas please put them in the comments below I need some help with this otherwise I can't uh, can't use my microwave at all uh, and like I said if I want to get like a a bowl of soup or something like or leftover food or something I can't even warm it up because it it won't allow me to run it that long at all so uh, yeah please leave your comments down below give me that thumbs up comment rate <laughs> whatever you got to do but please give me a hand here thanks guys